Okay, here we are on the AOPA flight planning. So let's put in our departure airport. We'll put K-U-A-O. And let's go ahead and go to, how about Seattle? K-S-E-A. Let's put in an altitude. Let's go ahead and put 8,000 feet. Let's change our routing to low airways and plan this route. Okay, so there's our whole route. So now what we can do is we go over here, hit save routing up at the top, click save. Okay, now we can bring up stored routes. So Aurora to Seattle. We're going to just right click on that and say create GPX file. And it's going to say save GPX. So down here at the bottom we're going to say save open folder. Now there it is Aurora to Seattle. Okay, there it is. So what we're going to do, there's our route, our GPX file. We're going to right click on it and we're going to say send to, there's our SD card, drive F, right down here on the bottom. And there it wrote to the SD card. Now we're done. Now we're going to take the SD card and go to the EFIS. Okay, we put our SD card into our EFIS. We're going to, flight plan is up. So we're going to select flight plan. We're going to then select file. There's the SD card. We're going to select down to Aurora to Seattle, which is what we just did on the PC, and we're going to push the knob to load it. There it is. Loaded the whole flight plan right into it from the PC. Nothing to it. You can also save this flight plan. So all we do is hit Flight Plan, File, let's hit Save. So we just saved the flight plan. So it'll let you save flight plans from the card or even from a 430 or 650, you can save a flight plan.